Good morning and welcome to Join News Interactive with me, Mpita Sibidi. I hope you had an awesome weekend. Uh, remember, you can catch us on DSTV Channel 421, Go TV Channel 144, and our live stream on YouTube is my Joy Online TV. On Facebook and Twitter, we are Joy News on TV. Welcome back from the weekend, folks. So let's get ready for success. Let's get ready to conquer this week. Let's get ready to just push out all the negative things out. But remember, the minority in parliament is demanding uh, for an immediate forensic audit into the accounts and activities of newly elected chairman of the governing party, Freddie Blair, for his show of vulgar opulence and vote buying towards the recent National Delegates con Congress. So now we asked you on Facebook, what do you make of this? And this is what you had to say. Uh, let's see if we can get those comments on the, your screens. Lagos GH says, Ghana being a democratic country, I personally see it as a good move. And at Abraham Smith says, forensic audits ought to be conducted because the cash influenced was too much. Dot, dot, dot. Jeremy up here says another way to say congratulations to Blay. Well, he's asking the question, is it another way to say congratulations to Blay? And at Maxwell Nana says, much I do about nothing. All right, let's go to Apia Kosi who says, why? Uh, that's not an important issue for corrupted minority to counter. What I personally do care is his name, Freddie Blair, as a Ghanaian, born at 61, a democratic politician after slavery. He should check ancestral family listed names to pick one. Okay. Interesting. Abraham comes in to say that so forensic audits ought to be conducted because of the cash influence was uh, too much. And Jerry Appiah says, well, ask the question again. Another way to say congratulations to Blair. Stephen says, not necessary. It will amount to nothing whether found guilty or not. Kamla says, 275 minibuses for party constituency, none for public ambulances. And Tia Izia says, it's just one of the trash from this double salaried um, I need to, my, minority from the NDC. And Maxwell says, much I do about nothing. And Briar Idrisu says, good. And Raphael Pari Limba says, great. It's a perfect demonstration of rule of law and trim. Francis says, Ghana sweet. Hashtag NPP conference has been trending for the past three days. So we're going to take some of your tweets on that. Remember, our hashtag was hashtag election HQ on Joy News on Facebook and Twitter. Let's start with Surgeon Dion who says, hashtag NPP conference. I'm beginning to think that Mr. C Stephen and Tim is an old student of Adisco. They've all been there four consecutive times and have lost all. Hmm, just thinking out loud. And at Barclays, Maxwell says, hashtag NPP conference will go into history as one of the best. Congratulations to all those who won. Uh, congratulations to the losers as well. All right, let's see if we can get another tweet on that. At uh, Shas underscore Claude says, such a peaceful event. I hope all the other parties would also have a peaceful event election hashtag npp conference and at f nyamin she says i would like um the congratulate the at npp underscore gh for a peaceful election of party executives to run the affairs of the party for the next four years let's together work hard to keep the party in power for the next 20 years and beyond it's victory once again for the NPP hashtag NPP conference. And at Mr. Kenzie says hashtag NPP conference. May God bless Ghana. And at Caleb Yes Lord says at Zoom line underscore GH, 
is doing a great work after the hashtag NPP conference, Kofiada Technical University. And this was after pictures of the fourth at the grounds was trending. But at Zula Karini says, congratulations to all elected national officers at NPP underscore GH. Better luck next time to all those who couldn't make it. Let's come together to work for victory. 2020 hashtag NPP conference. All right, at Avon Koku says, hashtag NPP conference. And Tim loses again. Freddie Blair elected chairman. And at Ernest 5398-5929, all he has to say is wow. Hashtag NPP conference. Now, arrest the dollar has been trending, and this is in response to the depreciating CD. Currently, a dollar to CD is 4.77, and uh, people have been complaining about this, and they're just saying, arrest the dollar, arrested, arrested. Let's see if we can get some tweets on that hashtag, arrest the dollar. So remember, Facebook and Twitter, we're Joy News on TV. We're also on YouTube as my Joy Online TV. So, okay, so as you can see, this is the CD right now. This is how we're doing. One uh, United States dollar equals 4.77 Ghanaian CD. I mean, it's hectic. So as you can see, the graph here from 2014, uh, 2015, 2016, 2017, and 2018. So from 2014 to 2018, this is the highest the CD has gone. So, I mean, people are, are not happy about this. Uh, let's see if we can get those tweets on hashtag arrest the dollar. Yeah, so we're going to the tweets now. Hashtag arrest the dollar. As you can see, at uh, Franklin Yankee says, when is Chief Inspector Baumea going to arrest the dollar for Ghanaians? And at underscore safety underscore says you cannot you cannot arrest the dollar. You claimed it was easy to accomplish if the right measures were put in place at Mbaumea. Hashtag arrest the dollar. And at Kwesi Zitsi says the CD to the dollar is getting weaker and weaker. We live in an economy where almost everything is important. Hence Ghanaians are suffering from two things imported infl uh, inflation and high exchange rates. You need to arrest it as promised, please. And at once the day says, can you please arrest the dollar for us at M. Baumea. At Kwabana Social says, when is Dr. Baumea going to arrest the dollar for us? And at Nanamo says, the dollar has never gotten to five even. Stop politicizing everything in this country. They promised to terrorize the dollar. Their word should be their bond. And at Kojo underscore Ethard says, boss, I'm a, I'm a top trained ex-US police officer. I go fit to help you arrest the dollar against the CD and also handcuff the oil prices. I will charge nothing all for Madagana at M Baumia DM if I am needed. Hashtag arrest the dollar. Now let's move on to the worldwide trends on on Twitter. Hashtag Monday motivation is trending. Actually motivation Monday is trending let's see what you guys have been saying and how you guys have been motivating us as you can see on your screens hashtag monday motivation is trending worldwide it's the number one trend and we also got exoplanet and hashtag dance the night away So let's take some of your tweets on hashtag motivation. How have you been motivating other people around the world? And at Penguin UK Books says, it's never too late to be what you might have been. And that's from George Elliott. It's never too late to be what you might have been. How lovely, how lovely. And at Tapelo says, 
you are a work in progress love who you're creating hashtag monday motivation i think this is very important for people who are always hard on themselves that you know what you're a work in progress and it's okay to be flawed you can be a uh, a broken piece and a masterpiece at the same time your work in progress love who you are creating i love that hashtag monday motivation and at cute aks says the better person you become the better person you will attract okay the better person you become the better person you will attract and at wussi tembakwaya says be kind to others you never know what war someone is fighting, what demons they're battling, or what burdens they carry. Just be kind. Hashtag Monday motivation. So just be kind. All right, at, uh, Chris, at prior underscore JII says, Bob Marley's last words were, money can't buy life. Hashtag Monday motivation. It doesn't matter if you've got five million in your account, if you've got five Ghana CDs in your account, money can't buy life. We're all going to die someday and you can't buy time. At Christo Tosin says, no matter how challenging your circumstances may be, go out, smile, and infect the world with laughter. Hashtag Monday motivation. And at business underscore motive says, hashtag Monday motivation. Number one, Stop complaining and appreciate how lucky you are every day. Number two, embrace loneliness and reinvent yourself in the process. And number three, say goodbye to the people that don't bring positive energy into your life. And number four, commit to the goals you set and never look back. So this one was from at Penguin UK Books. Let me read it for the last time. And it says, it is never too late to be what you might have been. So remember to always work on yourself, your process, love yourself the way you are. It's okay. But it's time for a break now. When I return, it's all about the World Cup. Stay tuned. <music> <laughs> all right that was our nsmq video i mean you know the Kumasi boys were talking and they were talking and it seemed like he knew what he was saying and he comes to say a key even his colleague is like ah what is that but you know what it's okay we all make mistakes but world cup news now 14 stand the number has been reduced from 32 that started the competition now it's france belgium england and croatia will slug it out for spot in the finals did you see the teams progressing to the stage which two teams will progress to the finals personally I'm rooting for France you know the other African team like you say on social media but let's go to Twitter and see what you guys have been saying at Peter Bruet says Belgium could be the best team out there all right, so these are some Belgium tweets because it's also been trending. So Belgium uh, could be the best team out there. And at Bernus underscore says, yes, Belgium is going to win. And at Darren AFC, uh, AFC says, 1979 says, boring knowing that no World Cup matches to watch tonight. Roland France versus Belgium tomorrow. Then the main event on Wednesday. At Sam Prezzo says, hashtag feel the bond, a hashtag connect with greatness. I'm Samuel. I support Belgium. I believe we'll be able to lift the trophy. I would like a Croatia jersey. Okay. And at Megan Marker HD says, the World Cup is ending on Saturday the 14th, and I'm sad, even if my team didn't play all along. France against Belgium and Croatia against England will be beautiful games. May the best win. So Croatia is also heading, well, hopefully we'll be heading to the finals. Let's see uh, what you guys have been saying about Croatia. At Fulham Flatter says, 
can't believe I actually fly to Croatia next Monday, day after the final. And we have them in the semis on Wednesday. I could be in for a very frosty reception. Hashtag World Cup 2018. England versus Croatia. Hashtag it's coming home. At underscore Nyambe says, I just hope Croatia sends England home on Wednesday or else we will never hear the end of it from English media if they do win the World Cup. And at Nya PFM says, even if England uh, l loses to Croatia, we'll still get another game against France or Belgium. Hashtag World Cup fever. And at Bra underscore Kojo says, Croatia will send England home. Hashtag World Cup. And at Gareth Clement 89 says, all these English ner uh, nervous uh, for the Croatia game. Not seen this many people worried about a semi since I watched Brokeback Mountain in the cinema. And at Ishana underscore 73 says, Who's blown away by the Russia and Croatia game? At Beardo9 says, I worry a little. Croatia have arguably one of the best midfields, and I'm not sure we have enough defensive minded midfielders to cope with that. And at Augusti3758, 1553 says, Croatia will win the World Cup hands down so let's go to our sixth african team and that is france and they've been trending let's see what you guys have been saying about them all the way to team france that's who i'm rooting for but what are you guys saying on twitter and at honey princess b says nah i see france winning so princess b and i are on the same team we both see france winning but at one, Amunia says, I prefer Belgium to France. And at Samuel says, uh, France is winning tomorrow, by the way. And at Malungu Wabi says, France won, Belgium won. So he's predicting there. And at Sam Walker says, as much as France is a good team, at Michael and Keep, Belgium is ruthless up front. Case. Look at how Lukaku and Hazard pulls defenders off to create room for De Bruyne. Hashtag feel the bond. Hashtag connect with greatness. So let's see if we can get more tweets on France there. All right, so we don't have any more tweets, but hashtag France, Belgium, Croatia, England. Who's taking it? Is it going to be a Harry Kane? Is it going to be a african team but let's move on to something i'm very excited about and from the 12th to the 15th of july the accra international conference center will host ghana's largest marriage based program and that's the joy fm bridal and beauty fair and will give you an opportunity to get all you want for your wedding so for our video of the day today we present you this performance from a wedding reception in nigeria enjoy <laughs> Listen, if I invite you to my wedding and you come and dance like that, I will like chase you away. Don't come to my wedding and dance like that. But on that wedding reception in Nigeria, notes, we're going to end today's show. Join is interactive with me, Mpito Sibidi. And remember to be kind to others. You never know what battles they're fighting, what demons they're fighting, and what war they're going through. So just 
be kind. On that note, I am going to leave you and I say stay blessed.